It is September 18th. I am in Boise, Idaho. This is the capital city of the state of Idaho. And we're gonna to talk to a guy named John Starr. John Starr is a realtor and land and property developer. And we're gonna to talk to him about what happened in the economic downturn, the bubble, if you will, to not only Idaho, but specifically what happened to Boise. My name is Henry Rollins. I'm embarking on a tour through every state capital in America, all the way up to November's presidential elections. I want to learn a few things, and knowledge without mileage equals bullshit. So come follow me into what Mark Twain called the territory. This is Capitalism 2012. Boise is more than just the city. It's the MSA, the Metropolitan Statistical Area. It's about 600,000 people, which means that it's half of the population of the entire state of Idaho. Before the real estate boom really took off in about 2000, 2001, a lot of people had started moving here for jobs and lifestyle. Jobs and lifestyle brings growth. Growth brings uh, production of new homes. Uh, demand, demand drives up prices. And so uh, for a while there, we were one of the fastest growing areas of the country. And as a consequence of that fast growth, we, we saw more than our, our fair share of the, of the downturn. You know, we, we just had more people buying more homes that were overpriced. And, and when the downturn came, we got hit real hard. At the very worst, there were probably 10,000 vacant developed house lots sitting on the ground with uh, no prospect of anybody purchasing them to build a house on. The main reason we are so slow in our recovery is we don't have a great diversity of jobs, of industries. If you live in the Silicon Valley and you lose your job, if you're an electrical engineer or an internet uh, specialist, you can go get another job across the street. Here in Idaho, if you lose that high-tech job, you gotta go to California to get the replacement job. How has the, the market recovered? What we have seen is we have seen the market step in and, and balance pricing, balance uh, ownership, and kind of rebalance the whole supply issue where, uh, yes, the homes have moved along. The, the people who lost their homes have moved along. The market has acted and uh, they are moving along into the future. Me and the road manager, road manager work and smell a record store for like a month. That way. He's, and so sometimes we show up, and we, we show up to the venue, hey, is that record store? It's gone. Oh, And that happens all too often. So it's always a relief to come back here and go to the record exchange. Tonight, we drive like crazy men to get to a place called Helena, Montana. Stay tuned. <laughs> 